Yeah, there's a sign that's telling the truth for change. Yeah, it looks like a motel to me. A oh, frontier. You ever hear of Frederick Turner, Mr. Oliver? No, sir. Well, he was an historian. About 100 years ago, he came up with a theory about the frontier. He said the frontier was a safety valve for civilization, a place for people to go to keep from going mad. So whenever there were folks who couldn't fit in with the way things were, nuts, malcontents, and extremists, they'd pack up and head for the frontier. That's how America got started. All the crackpots and troublemakers in Europe packed up and went to a frontier, which became the 13 colonies. When some people couldn't fit in with that, they moved farther west, which is why all the nuts eventually ended up in California. <laughs> Turner died in 1932, so he wasn't around long enough to see what would happen to the world when we ran out of frontier. As some people say, we have the frontier of the mind, and they go off and explore the wonderful world of alcohol and drugs, but that's no frontier. It's just another way for us to fool ourselves. And we've created this phony frontier with computers, which allows people to you know, think they've escaped. Frontier with access fees. What about space? You know, the final frontier. Ah, uh, Star Trek isn't space. That's television. Fine fucking frontier that is. Besides, how many folks can just back up and go to space? Nah, the frontier is right here. Interstate 60. That's why it was put here. Give people who wanted something a little different a place to go. Is that really true, Mr. Cody? If it isn't, it should be.